Hi folks, in the current situation with virus, masks are very valuable and many people are overpaying in order to get them. So let's see which masks help protect against the virus and which are practically useless against it. 95% of people who wear masks wear the most simple ones. Let's take a closer look. When we zoom in, it can be seen how big are the vents between the fibers of the mask and the virus can easily get through the mask. After all, the droplets with the virus are so small that the mask certainly will not stop them. See what happens when the person sneezes. And it still hangs in air for a long time. But this isn't far from the main problem. It's the main drawback, the huge gaps around the permanence of the mask. The air you breathe usually comes in through the least resistant and rest assured that air will go through this uh, on cheeks, near nose and near chin. To demonstrate the way in which air comes and goes, we will release it from our mouth a little smoke from vape. See where it comes from, exactly the way air you breathe in, you enter. That's it, definitely not through a mask. I believe this mask is almost useless in terms of protection against the virus. The only thing it does, it saves other people from large spl splashes from your sneeze if you're infected. For this reason, it's still worth wearing it if you have nothing else. Next we have this type of mask. We don't have the best option, but the gaps are not so large. Although the quality of the filter leaves much to be desired. The next type is this one. The more rigid type and uh, with inhalation wealth. Near the nose it has a small sponge which contributes to a better fit of this part of the face. We try to inhale with smoke and we see there are practically no leaks. Smoke e exits through the valve and not around the mask. Well there is a little leak near the eyes but it's very different what we observed earlier. I think that 90% of the inhaled air will pass through this filter element. And let's take a closer look. To take a sample of the layers, we make a, such a neat hole in the mask around here. So the later on we can still use uh, with something else and mask would not deteriorate. Because we don't have many four layers, each of them perform its own function. This layer is so dense that even light will not pass through it. The mask has a class of protection FFP1, which is not enough for 100% protection against the virus, but it's at least some kind of protection compared to the previous options. Now consider a mask with a FP3 protection level, which deters all viruses. With such a mask, it's really not scary to go out into public places. There is a rubber band laid around the inner perimeter, which should provide very good contact with one's face. Try looking in hardware stores on online. It will replace dozens of ordinary masks, because it's reusable. But after each time you need to disinfect the mask, and it won't be the best in a warm place and dry environment. So, as the virus dies in the heat. So, for that you can put mask in the oven for half an hour by setting the temperature to 70 degrees. The virus cannot withstand more than 65% of degrees. Or you can just leave the mask for example on the balcony for two days, but not only under the sun since the ultraviolet rays destroy the structure of its filter. The coolest type which you could probably have 100% protection and it fits comfortably with these reusable masks with the replaceable filters. Look how thick they are. It will filter out anything. A rigid frame and soft rubber around the perimeter will provide a perfect fit. We bought this mask just a few days ago on the internet. Yes, it's not cheap, but it can be handy in household. They are ex exhaled through this large valve 
and breathing is not that easy compared to the other masks. But to protect the breath, this is far from the 100% protection against the virus because it can get through our eyes. For this, you need to use glasses. Ordinary glasses are bad to cope with this function, although it's better than nothing. But you can get this one in construction store. It will give you noticeable protection for your eyes, as it protects from all sides. And the best option is swimming goggles. If they don't pass anything underwater, then they will not pass any virus as well. As a result, we consider this configuration as an ideal set for survival in epidemic. Yes, you will look really unusual and weird, probably people will look at you, but in such situation, your appearance should be last thing you should worry about. Think about your health and the health of your loved ones first. Be sure to wash your hands with soap as much as possible and don't touch your face with dirty hands. In this case, you have a minimum chance of picking up something unpleasant. Share this video with your friends and loved ones and take care of yourself.